Hello everyone and welcome to GeoGuster with the Strange Lands crew. We have Matt in the hat here. Hello. Focus. Centra. And I am Fixer. How's everybody doing today? Pretty good. On this fine Friday morning. I hate the Centras. Talkus is full of hate. It's the mark yep. of the East. Talkus is full of hate. Pass the hate. Alright, so anyways, today is custom GeoGuster challenge. We have a custom challenge brought to us by Michael Mosca or Mosca. Sorry if I butcher your name. This has an Australian theme to it. How is your Australian GeoGuster skills, guys? Poor to fair. Bah. Wait, so this is in the West, but it bears the mark of the East. Yeah, yeah, I was about to say that. You keep on complaining about the East, but this, according to Talkus logic, is in the West. You know what this means? You know what this means, right? The adversary, the, the nudely appendages of the fine spaghetti monster have spread even to Australia. No. So anyways, this is in the retro style GeoGuessr, which means there's no built-in timer. We're going to set ourselves a manual two-minute timer per round. So if you want to compare your scores to ours, please set the same limitations on your own. Is everybody... Oh, see it in the description. Is everybody ready? Yep. You did our conference button, my empire. There you go. Three, two, one, go. Get that timer started. Bam. All right. So where are we at here? We're in Fullerton Park, obviously. I don't know where Fullerton is. And we have Hughes Gallery, readers, blah, blah, blah. Looking for some kind of city name. I don't know if Fullerton is, a, is just the name of the road or if it is a city as well. So we're looking. Oh, my gosh. I'm in this store. Vertex. Any other kind of info, fellas? Let's go down this way. Invitations, wedding, christening, country bumpkin. Fantastic. All right, let's get a tentative guess down here. My, uh, we got mountains over there. Where are the mountains in Australia? I don't even know. I don't know what I'm doing here. Um. I don't know where the mountains are. There we go. All right, so let's go with um, by Coffs Harbor for now. Dentist, Highgate. Nice dentist. Chartered accountants. Any kind of city name, guys, would be very helpful. Flowers by Alice. No city name? Okay. Aha! Murray Bridge, Glen Osman, Mitchum. What is all that stuff? Mitchum, Bel Air. Are those are those actual cities? I don't know. Harvey Bay, Gladstone. I'm guessing those are cities. At least Mitchum and Bel Air. I don't know. I'm going further. Time's up anyways. Time's up. Make a guess. Well then, um, I didn't know there were mountains down there. I don't see them on the map. Anyways, with the mountains in the background, I looked for mountains on the map. I found some on the east coast. I went with that. Got 2059. I couldn't really find any city names through all that crap. I see Bel Air now. But it's pretty small. Anyways, 2059, how'd you do, Matt? Uh, I ended up on the East Coast as well, 2162. You have to zoom in way far to see the only name you could see. Fullerton. Yeah, and there's Fullerton as well, but I didn't... I don't know. I wasn't sure if Fullerton was going to be the name of the city or just the road. Looks like it's yeah. not even a city, is it? It's just an area? It's like, yeah, like a um, borough a almost. Yeah. A neighborhood. Uh, talk us. Well, this is this is Adelaide, and this is where our Berg lives. So I was, and I, I guess I was trying to channel my inner Berg Evans. Also, there's a, a park in the center that like goes around the city center. That's really cool. I, I like the city. It's, it's a cool city. But I, I just saw the Fullerton was the name of the town, so I went all around the coast trying to find Fullerton, but alas, I failed. And then I figured that it, it might be just a neighborhood thingy, 
So I went with a, a Sydney neighborhood and got 2139. Alrighty then. Well, round two, you guys ready? Affirmative. Yep. Three, two, one, go. My timer started. Looks like we're starting in the middle of nowhere. Okay, so let's go south. And it looks like I may have chosen... Was that a washing machine? There was a washing machine on the side of the road. Oh, great. Now I have... Oh, oh, oh. Highland Park. All right, so let's go that way. Please give... There we go. I like... Nice camera. So we have Bowerville to Pacific Highway. All right. So let's go on the East Coast then and look for a, a Bowerville... Let's put a tentative guess there. Let's maybe zoom in a little bit here. There's a Naura right there. But we're looking for Bowraville. Newcastle. Not a so far Harrington. Southwest. Nambucca. No Bowraville though. Byron Bay. I think I might leave my guess where it is. Maybe let's go down the road a little bit. Shopping Village. That doesn't give me anything. How about this sign here? Great. Well, that doesn't help. How about over here? More Bowerville to Pacific Highway, Old Coast Road. So it's got to be this highway here, I would assume. Wagga wagga. Oh no, I don't mean to move it. Go back. Central Coast. All right, I don't know. I don't know where Bowerville is going to be. But I think everybody's going to guess the East Coast once they see the Pacific Highway. All right, time's up. Make a guess. So, funny enough, this is almost exactly where I guessed in the first round, I think it was. Or was it the second one? Anyways, there was a sign for the Pacific Highway, which I assumed was on the East Coast. I saw Bowerville, but I couldn't find it on the map. So I guessed East Coast, got 2654. How'd you do, Matt? I didn't see the East Coast Highway thing, but I still kind of guessed uh, near where it ended up. Uh, just up in Queensland and so down in New South Wales, but 26-24. And Talkus. That's interesting. For some reason, I thought that the, uh, the Pacific Ocean would have, like be all around Australia, but no, looks like I guess it isn't on the east. Oh, well, more than you know, I guessed in the south-ish bit and got 1973. All right, next round. You guys ready? Yeah. Yep. And three, two, one, go. I think uh, I may have pulled ahead a little bit there. All right, so we're in a city, obviously. And which city would that be? Stonyfell. I want to move. I want to see what's on the bus. Natural gas, clean and green. Nothing on the bus. All right. So we got some... Wow, we got a dead end is what we got. All right. I didn't want to go down that way anyway. Discount souvenirs. So we have a city that's got a touristy area. Singapore Airlines. Lovely. Are we actually... What's this? Colonial Mutual Life Building. Alright. So let's go with... Um, let's go with Sydney to start. I don't know if this is Sydney or not. Let's go there to start. Hayes Chocolates. Charlesworth. Isn't isn't there a Charlesworth like in Tasmania? King William. I got a hiccup. Um I, I I'm seeing no city signs. This is awful. TNT. It's dynamites. That is not an Australian flag, so that's probably an embassy. So if that is an embassy, 
Should I guess down here in, in, in Canberra? I think I should. I'm going with Canberra, I think. I mean, there, there's possibly embassies in Sydney. I don't know. I don't know how embassies work. But I'm going to guess that they're probably mostly focused on capitals. That's just a guess, though. Time's up. Make a guess. So we're back in Adelaide, I guess. Well, anyways, um, I couldn't find any signs for any cities or anything like that. I did run across an embassy. Uh, well, what I assume was an embassy. Um, so I guessed in Canberra. Got 2194. How'd you do, Matt? I put it in Melbourne. We got 2336. This is actually not too far from the other one we had um, by the park. Uh, talk us, how'd you do? Yeah, I wonder where this person lives. Mm. Um, I uh, On the initial bus that you're looking at, if you zoom in, it says Adelaide Metro. And I managed to find Grand South Street and got 6466. See, I was looking oh, at nice. the bus yeah, and I couldn't, I, couldn't... I couldn't get anything off the bus. Well, you like my eagle eyes, born for a lifetime on a diet of pure corn. Pure corn, eh? Yeah, you know it. All right, next round. You guys ready? Yeah. Yep. Three, two, one, go. Got to get my timer restarted. Talkus has probably pulled ahead just a little bit. So I'm not going to win this one, but let's see if I can pull off a miracle win at the year. Imperial Hotel. There's a sign right here as well that might get us. Oh, great. Let's hop over to the other side again. That might as get us a city name. East Gippsland? Does that say Gippsland Livestock Exchange? Gippsland? What kind of place is it called Gippsland? Oh, here we go. Painesville. A1 Lakes Entrance. A1. All right. Painesville. Let's look for A1. I'm guessing... This, okay, so we're back over here. So we're looking for Gips or Pains. Gips and Pains. There's Gypsy Point. Oop, there's Lakes Entrance. All right, all right, Lakes Entrance. Is that a, like an actual name of a city, Lakes Entrance? That's kind of strange, isn't it? So C604, we need to look for C604. There's Gippsland Lakes. I think we maybe Lakes Entrance is up. So would we be on this side then? We got 30 seconds. Painesville. There's Barnsdale. A1. There's Painesville. Painesville's to the left. So I think we're right about there. No. If Painesville's to the left. And it's right here. But Lake's Entrance... Oh, that's C... That don't make no sense. Unless it's, like, up here. Unless we're not on either of those roads. I'm leaving it there. Time's up. Make a guess. Alright, so I saw signs for... Um, Gippsland. Nice name. And there was a sign for Lakes Entrance, which I didn't think was a city name at first, but apparently it is. In Painesville, A1, all these different signs. So I guessed up by Bairnsdale and got 6,023. I was um, five kilometers away. How'd you do, Matt? Holy cow. I saw a sign for C604 or 603, and so I spent a lot of time looking for highways that started with C. Ended up in Melbourne, uh... 2748. us. I found Highway A1, and that led me to the City of Lakes Entrance, where I guessed and got 4589. This is going to be a close one. I caught up at that last guess there. Let's see no! how we did. You, you probably beat me by a little bit, but I made it close. I'm sure Matt will win somehow. He always does. Oh, we got one more. Never Maybe mind. More fix. Three, yeah. two, one, go. Okay, we got one more. This is going to decide it. If I get another good guess like that, I should win. There's probably something... What does that say? Some Raffles Royale. 
All right, my mouth is dry and I didn't, I didn't get a a uh, water for this session for some stupid reason. All right, 7-Eleven. They got 7-Elevens, eh? Budget. Where are we, guys? Here we go. Carnival and race day. We're on the coast, I think. Re well, first of all, I'm going to go with Adelaide as a starting guess. But uh, I don't know if that's where we're at. Only because he's done... All right, this is Cypress Avenue. Southport. All right, let's... Southport. Chevron Island. Is that what that says? There's a Chevron Island? That's Kangaroo Island. Nice name. All right, let's look for Chevron Island in the south. What was that? Flinders? Australia is so weird with their names. St. Peter's. Oh, boy. Islands. These don't look like they're inhabited. Hope Town. Um, I don't think it's over there. I think we're in the southeast. All right, we have a Chevron Island over here. King Island. There's Flinders, Cape Barren. Are there two Flinders Islands? Sunday Snake. Saint something. French. Philip. All right, I'm sticking with Adelaide. Time's up. Make a guess. I guess I should not have stuck with Adelaide and South Island or whatever it was called. Son of a bad word. So anyways, there was a, a Southern Island or something like that. Southern Port. I think it was Southern Port. And there was a sign for... What the hell was the island name? I don't even see it on here. Did you guys see it? Nope. Nope. Anyways, I saw the name of the island and I looked everywhere for it. Got, I guessed in Adelaide because he had two other guesses in Adelaide. 2027, how'd you do, Matt? He just put them there twice to throw us off. Yeah. Um... I ended up in Sydney, and like, with 30 seconds left, I was just like, you know, this is going to be something dumb, like, oh, Brisbane is a really popular surfing place or something, and I... 2314. There it is. It's Chevron Island. That's the sign I saw was Chevron Island, and I was looking everywhere for that. Uh, talk us, how'd you do? Wow, this Gold Coast place looks to have a lot of weird canal things. Oh, that's kind of neat. That's weird. I don't know. It's interesting. Um, I saw a ton of signs for Gold Coast, but I didn't think that it would be uh, a city name. I just thought it was the name of the buses or whatever. Um, so I just went in Sydney again and got 23 double 11. I do yeah, this, this is all, all crazy man-made stuff. Um, fun fact that's not related to Australia in any way, but it would still blow your mind. If you look at Texas on a map, and look for all the water areas, know that in Texas there is only one natural lake in all of Texas. All the rest are man-made. Neat. The and, South. Yeah, the crazy South. Only one natural... It's, it's crazy how many lakes that we actually build. Anyways, let's see what our final score is. All right. Texas is mostly West. I always forget that. Yep. So... I ended up with a, a fairly respectable 14,957. How'd you do, Matt? Uh, you beat me, 12,184. This forms like a triangle. We're, they, we didn't even have any in the West. He focused everything in the Southeast. That's where most of the population is, I think, though. Yeah. Uh, talk us, how'd you do? Uh, talk the Valiant received a 1, a 7, a 4, a 7, and a 8. You did indeed. Woo! Matt and I are winning, buddies. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> well, because you always win at things, and now I just won, so now we we won together. 
That's Tucker's logic. Don't question it. Well, well, Matt always wins. Okay, name one thing that Matt has not won. Literally never win. It's okay. Well, name one game that Matt hasn't has uh, doesn't win. This one. No, no, he wins all the time. No, I meant this specific game today. Yeah, this specific game today, I did not win either time. Yeah, but I I won. Anyways, special thanks. At champion, I pass on my title. Special thanks to Michael Mosca for this Australian challenge. Uh, if you guys played along, share your comments, uh, scores in the comments below and all that jazz. And if you'd like to submit one yourself, go to geosetter.com and uh, make a theme challenge or just a random challenge, whatever you want. We like to play it. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next Friday. Bye.